Continue to follow a developing story of fire out of Dayton. We're now learning the coroner has arrived on the scene. Two News reporter Kiana Dyke just joins us live on Valley Street with the latest. Lauren, still a very active scene here. You can now see that mobile home where the fire started just behind me here. We have both fire and police crews on the scene, and we're told that is because investigators are still trying to, to trying to determine if the person who died was in fact killed by this fire. I'll step out of the way so you can see a little closer what's going on here. You can see the amount of damage on this house here and the camper right next to it. They sit near the intersection of Valley Street and Valley Crest Drive. The mobile home here is where the fire started. According to the chief, it started just before 4 o'clock this morning. He says crews responded immediately and were able to put that fire out. The fire chief has confirmed that one person was found dead. They were in the camper. In the camper. They were in the camper. And we did have reports that there was someone who was, you know, using the camper um, as, as, I don't know if it was a, you know, their, their home location or whatever. So we had a sense that we needed to make sure that there was, you know, someone not in the, in there and unfortunately we did find them deceased. We're still working to learn more information about this fire. For now, live in Dayton, Keanu Deitch's 2 News Today, working for you.